Hello, thank you for joining me today. We're reading through A Course in Miracles, the daily lessons, and today we're on workbook lesson 248. Whatever suffers is not a part of me. Whatever suffers is not a part of me. I have disowned the truth. Now let me be as faithful in disowning falsity. Whatever suffers is not a part of me. What grieves is not myself. What is in pain is but illusion in my mind. What dies was never living in reality and did but mock the truth about myself. Now I disown self-concepts and deceits and lies about the Holy Son of God. Now I am ready to accept him back as God created him and as he is. Father, my ancient love for you returns and lets me love your son again as well. Father, I am as you created me. Now is your love remembered and my own. Now do I understand that they are one. This is a beautiful lesson. Let me read it again. Whatever suffers is not part of me. Whatever suffers is not part of me. I have disowned the truth. Now let me be as faithful in disowning falsity. Whatever suffers is not part of me. What grieves is not myself. What is in pain is but illusion in my mind. What dies was never living in reality and did but mock the truth about myself. Now I disown self-concepts and deceits and lies about the Holy Son of God. Now I am ready to accept him back as God created him and as he is. Father, my ancient love for you returns and lets me love you, your son, again as well. Father, I am as you created me. Now is your love remembered and my own. Now do I understand that they are one. So again, you are not your body. You're, you're using your body as housing. And so suffering and pain are uh, constructs of the body and of the 3D realm. They don't exist in the realm of divinity. So I hope you have a great lesson or day with this lesson today. And um, I'll hope to see you here again tomorrow for the next daily lesson. You can feel free to reach out to me on Facebook or on YouTube or um, at 907-351-3003 or lindalamp.com or lindalamp.shop. Thanks again. We'll see you tomorrow. Much love. Namaste.